Russia, whose leader is accused of war crimes, assumed charge of the United Nations Security Council on Saturday. This was the response from Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky. Unfortunately, we also have news that is obviously absurd and destructive. Today, a terrorist state began to chair the UN Security Council. The last time Russia held the rotating presidency of the body responsible for maintaining peace and combating acts of international aggression was in February 2022. That was when Moscow troops launched a full-scale invasion of Ukraine, which the Kremlin calls a special military operation. The move has caused fury in Ukraine. In his daily video address, Zelensky highlighted that Russian shelling had killed a five-month-old boy on Friday and criticized the Security Council. It's hard to imagine anything that proves more the total bankruptcy of such institutions. The presidency rotates alphabetically each month among the 15 members. Although it's largely procedural, the Kremlin and other Russian officials vowed to, quote, exercise all its rights in the role. The United States on Thursday urged Russia to, quote, conduct itself professionally when it assumes the role, saying there was no means to block Moscow from the post. In March, the International Criminal Court, an international justice body not associated with the UN, issued an arrest warrant for President Vladimir Putin. He's accused of the war crime of illegally deporting hundreds of children from Ukraine. Some 400 days into the war, which has killed thousands, destroyed Ukrainian cities and set millions of civilians to flight, Russia continues to take over parts of the country, pressing on with its assault in the east.